Solar panels are one of the cheapest and most efficient ways of generating electricity, but they also take up a lot of space. They're commonly mounted on roofs. Now, scientists are calling for governments to invest in floating solar panels. But what about the impact on the aquatic environment underneath the panels? Have a look. Could floating solar panels be the next big innovation in the renewable energy sector? Scientists say installing solar panels on lakes and ponds is a good way to save space and spare land for other uses like agriculture. But the environmental impacts are still unknown. And that's what researchers at Cornell University are trying to figure out. We're trying to get a better understanding for what happens when you put floating solar on a water body. At the Cornell Experimental Pond Facility in New York State, researchers are floating nearly 400 solar panels across three ponds. Ecologist Steve Grotsky and his team are examining how these photovoltaic panels affect the water, microbes, plants and fish living in it. Uh, one of the issues uh, with, with floating solar is that we're not very sure what the effects are uh, ecologically, socially and so on in terms of putting solar on water bodies. The team is also tracking the pond's greenhouse gas emissions, algae growth, bioacoustics and environmental DNA. A whole suite of ecological um, attributes and trying to better understand the interactions between the floating solar deployments and the aquatic ecosystems that we're seeing, you know, preliminarily some, some somewhat rapid changes, for example, uh, where plants are growing in these ponds. Floating solar panels could save 5 million acres of land in the United States and would meet 10% of the country's electricity needs. That's according to legislators proposing the scheme. Grotsky says while interest in waterborne solar panels is rising, the technology must incorporate sustainability from the start to avoid any future unintended consequences.